What is up YouTube? I'm A Benna and today we have episode two of Aaron Blake's career. If you watched episode one, you know we got picked up by Atlanta. They gave us a 10 day contract and now we're just trying to earn a spot on the team, earn a spot on the rotation. And we are playing Brooklyn. One of the teams that cut Aaron in the tryouts and as he gets his first call up here, he's really going out there to prove a point, make Brooklyn pay for the mistakes, and uh, really show the team what he has, what he has to offer. We got our first minutes here, um, playing at small forward. We should be covering Joe Johnson on defense, and we take a shot right here, and we blow it. Uh, he can hit standing three, standing jump shots, but if you give him any reason to miss, He'll probably he'll probably miss nine times nine out of ten times he's gonna miss that shot. As we're covering Darren Williams here, I don't know why, but we do get a block right there, sending it right back down Darren Williams' throat. And um, one of the strong points of, of of having a good small forward is they can block shots. I played point guard throughout most of my careers, and I love having a small forward for that reason. It's so much easier on defense. As we try to get a pick here, it just doesn't happen, and we miss another shot. Al Horford misses a layup. I don't know why people miss layups in this game. They really got to fix that in 2K16. Ronnie 2K, get at it. But right here, Badanovic gets a wide open layup and misses the open layup. Something 2K needs to work on, but hey, eye for an eye. We miss one, you miss one, and we get a shot here and <laughs> drain it, make him pay for leaving him open. Aaron Black, eight, setting the tone, three points in a block, and just under, I think about a minute and a half, so, good gameplay, play some solid defense right there, trying to run up the court, Carroll's having a tough time getting it up, you're not a point guard, pass it out, man, ooh, with the footwork, with the spin, oh my god, Aaron Blake, putting it work like he's young black mamba, like he's the young mamba. Five points, shooting 50% from the field. We did miss those two, two f f first two jump shots. Trying to catch up over here, and it doesn't happen. They get an open layup on us. Joe Johnson, who we should have been covering from the beginning, but for some reason we were covering Darren Williams. I'll take it. Small forward covering a point guard. Mismatch of the year. We get a pick here, nice pick. Still can't get any separation. Oh, but he flops, and Aaron gets his first dunk in the NBA in his career, and he's running up. Look how excited he is. He looks like a puppy out the pet shop. Oh, man. Right there, playing some solid defense. Darren Williams looking like he's trying to waste some clock. Gets it over to Young. Passes it back, and I feel like it's going to, it's going to Joe Johnson, but it's not. Trying to move the ball up fast, and... Ah oh, man, they've got. That's another thing they need to work on. If you pass the the team, your teammate, the ball in my career with about four seconds, they'll shoot it with two seconds left on the clock. Dude. Okay, guys, let's focus and get down to business. Now, here's a few things I took away from the first half. Continue to have smart possessions. Let's keep the turnovers to a minimum. That was a big boost to our offense. But we did get a nice lift off the bench in that half. I might want to stay with some of those hot hands, so everybody be ready. And then the third and fourth quarters, guys, don't let our commitment to rebounding slow down our transition game. Let's still be quick to get out on the break. We know we can take their best punches and hang with them. Now it's time to hit them with everything we got and see how they handle it. First couple of games, we're gonna, we're gonna flash, flash forward to our next uh, appearance and hopefully it's not uh, walking off the court. So right here you have us. We're still covering Joe Johnson. I'm going to give him some space but I'm always ready to step back over there. Cover him. We get a shot there and we get a rebound. Our second rebound of the game. Passing it out to the Teague. Horford lets it go. Oh man, Horford. Not really your best night, but that's alright. <clears throat> yeah, but John, Joe Johnson is uh, pretty tough right here. Similar situation to what he did to Paul Pierce. We get the steal. Running it up and he's passing it for the assist. Great pass. Great court vision. 
terrible speed. Um, terrible speed. I don't know what else to say. I could not get past anyone. I was trying to take it all the way, but that was not going to happen. I'll take the assist. We'll take two points. Only down by two here. We get another rebound. Passing it out to the point guard. And, uh... These, these first couple of games are tough. They really are, especially when you... When you're, um... A bigger player, it's tough to get the ball. It's tough to get them to pass you the ball. And when they do, it's really... The hardest part is getting any amount of space as he flops right there. I don't know why he flops. But... They will get his strength up eventually. No big deal. No big deal as we play some defense. We did have a pretty sick hoop right there, bringing it up to nine. So we have nine points, three rebounds, assist, and a block. And another assist right there. Back to Teague. And uh, he can really, he's playing point forward right now. Jeff Teague not really having a solid night. He's only got, he's two for six. Seven points, two rebounds. And uh, th both, his, both his field goals were assisted on by Blocke. Boom. Oh, we should have had that board. Should have had that board. Come on. I'm really trying to get the steal here. You know you want to pass it. You don't pass it. He plays with the footwork and hits the side of the backboard. What are you doing, dude? Oh, oh block. Blake gets another block. This time on Joe Johnson as he lets it fly. And oh, couldn't, couldn't finish up the nice sequence. That would have been real nice if we got it right there. But I still think we're having a pretty solid game. It's 9 points, 3 rebounds, 2 assists, and 2 blocks. First game ever undrafted. Uh, came came in through a tryout. Really proving he belongs here. We have a 2 point lead. We try to play some defense right there. We were late, but unfortunately he does miss it. We get the last second shot and we blow it. It's okay, we don't get the shot, but going in the 4th. Up by 2. Not sure if I'm going to be playing in the 4th or not, but I don't think so. Um, <clears throat> really proud of his performance. Great performance out there. Uh, and yeah, okay, so we don't play the fourth. 74 to 78. Finishing nine points, three rebounds, two assists, two blocks, zero steals. Four for eight, shooting 50% from the field, one for three from three point range, which isn't terrible, but it's not great either. So our plus minus was 11, so that's always great. You did good tonight, Rook. Hey. That's what I'm here for, man. Defense, rebounding. Fill me Easy, up. bro. Even a blind squirrel finds an acorn every once in a while. Hold up, play. I see just fine. And based on my stats tonight, I see great. One game out of many? You got to bring that stuff every night. Oh, don't worry. I'm going to be here. I don't doubt it. All I'm saying is it's, long, it's a long season. Use this as a step, something to build on. Watch the tape. Be a professional. Any playground fool can catch fire one night. It takes a pro to do it consistently, you feel me? Yeah, I feel you. Good. So we can see here after that game, we put we did boost our jump shot up one and we put up our athleticism. Um, one of the things I noticed during the game was he really couldn't had no speed, no acceleration. We really need to work on that. And the jump shot, we should we should be able to be. We, I want to be able to hit more contested shots, or at least shots with a little bit of separation, mid-range shots, and so on and so forth. But until next time, guys, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed, subscribe, hit that like button, leave a comment. And until next time, I love y'all. Bye.